be required to wear masks in public. Open up the WCNC Charlotte mobile app or head on over to WCNC.com slash vote and weigh in. Before we look at those results, defender Nathan Morabito explains it's a practice major retailers started requiring for their employees in recent weeks. First, they were optional for workers inside area stores. Now grocery stores are requiring their employees wear them. And Mecklenburg County says customers could be next. Step inside any Charlotte store and you'll see a mix of customers with and without masks or homemade face coverings. But as Mecklenburg County plans for businesses to reopen, these may no longer be optional. I would suggest that for the retail that we are really looking at the possibility of requiring that and really recommending it for folks coming in. From Target to Walmart, Harris Teeter to Publix and many other stores, face covers are now required for workers. The added safety measure in addition to extra sanitizing and plexiglass. The masks are supposed to fit tightly with no gaps, cover your nose and mouth, and you're not supposed to touch them when in use. The health director said this week, masks are now readily available. And the CDC has said homemade face covers fashioned out of cloth are an effective alternative. The thicker it is, the less particle, the fewer particles that are going to get through it but that's balanced out a little bit by you need to be able to breathe comfortably. The state is expected to make a recommendation on face coverings this week as part of the governor's phased in reopening plan. I think North Carolina will be better off at the end of the day if we do this with care and not haste. The state calling them a good defense to COVID-19, but not as good as hand washing and cleaning or the most effective deterrent, social distancing and staying home. Right now, these face coverings are not mandatory for the general public, but as we mentioned, grocery stores are requiring their employees to wear them. So are they? Our Defenders investigation found not everyone is. Tonight at 6, two major chains respond to our findings. Nate Morabito, WCNC Charlotte.